Hello everyone, I am John Clifford Verona and today I'll be discussing the effects of disasters. Well, explore how disasters impact various aspects of society and what steps can be taken to mitigate their effects. Let's get started. Do you ever wondered about the impact of disasters like Typhoon Haiyan? Let's explore. In 2013, Typhoon Haiyan struck the Philippines, showcasing the profound effects disasters can have. With over 6,000 deaths and millions displaced, it highlighted the human toll. Economically, it caused immense damage to infrastructure and agriculture. Environmentally, it led to significant devastation. This disaster undercores the urgent need for disaster preparedness and mitigation efforts to minimize such impacts in the future. The first effect of disaster is medical effect. In disaster risk reduction or DRR, the medical effects refer to the impact disasters have on public health, healthcare systems, and individuals' well-being. These effects encompass various aspects including injuries and trauma. Disasters often cause physical injuries ranging from minor cuts and bruises to severe trauma such as fractures, burns, and head injuries. Immediate medical attention is crucial to address these injuries and prevent further complications. Damage to critical facilities In the aftermath of Typhoon Haiyan in Tacloban, critical facilities such as hospitals, schools, and emergency response centers suffered extensive damage, severely compromising the city's ability to provide essential services and respond effectively to the disaster. This highlighted the urgent need for disaster risk reduction or DRR measures to strengthen infrastructure, resilience, and ensure continuity of vital services during the future emergencies. During the initial stages of a disaster, almost all surface means of transportation within a community are disrupted by broken bridges, roads, and streets that are rendered impossible by landslides or floods. One of the scenarios of disruption of transportation is caused by an earthquake wherein bridges and roads or highway used in the land of transportation has cracks or damages that, will, that later or sooner will collapse that will cause accidents to the people of that area. Because of these problems, the land of transportation will be affected in the community and the citizens will wait until those damages on in infrastructure are fixed. Natural disaster exert profound economic impacts. Firstly, they cause physical damage to infrastructure resulting direct economic losses. Secondly, this disruption to economic activities lead to lost revenues and decreased productivity affecting various sectors. Additionally, loss of life of human capital diminish productivity and long-term economic output. Moreover, governmental costs in providing relief and rebuilding efforts. Furthermore, natural disaster disrupt tourism and trade, exacerbating economic downturns. Lastly, increased insurance cost burden business and individual. Understanding this impact is crucial for implementing effective disaster preparedness and recovery strategies to mitigate economic losses and facilitate sustainable recovery. Environmental change refers to the alterations in the Earth's natural systems driven by various factors such as human activities, natural processes, and external influences. These changes can affect ecosystems, climate patterns, biodiversity, and the availability of resources, impacting both natural and human environments. Environmental change encompasses phenomena such as climate change, deforestation, pollution, habitat destruction, and biodiversity loss which have far-reaching implications for ecosystems, societies, and economies worldwide. Addressing environmental change requires understanding its causes, impacts, and interconnections. 
as well as implementing strategies to mitigate its negative effects and promote sustainability and resilience. Social and Political Impact When a disaster happens, it can really mess things up for people and the government. Socially, disaster can make people lose their homes, even their lives, and mess with their minds. People must struggle to find food, water, and a safe place to stay. It can also break up communities and make people lose trust in each other. Politically, disaster can show if the government is doing a good job or not. If they handle things badly, people might get mad and not trust them anymore. Disaster also highlights issues like who gets help and who doesn't, which can make people question fairness. So, disaster are not just about physical damage, they shake up society and politics in a big ways.